I would say among the heroes and the sheroes. Or should I say the sheroes and the heroes? I was hoping to see more sheroes today, to be honest with you, but I find the hall is full of uh, a lot of men, which is nice because uh, the men need to hear a little bit more about you know the concerns that we have, and uh, they need to recognize their role in creating a better world for the women. Whether it's a girl or a, or a boy, uh, I would say this is the time for you to recognize and know your work. You should know what is your true passion, what really inspires you, what are your priorities. Because once you know that, you will possibly take a very focused approach towards achieving those goals, achieving those priorities. Women in general, we tend to be multitasking. Most of us are born with that ability. We try to do a lot of things at the same time and try to also give 100% to all the things at the same time. So it doesn't really result in a very uh, concrete output. So it's very necessary, whether it is a man or a woman, to really know your worth, know your strengths, be confident and give your maximum energy to that particular field of work or field of passion. Otherwise, you may end up being frustrated or you may burn out very quickly. So this is something which I would especially tell all the women out here. So I see a lot of lecturers and stuff. Uh, you are all great multitaskers, but don't be too hard on yourself. I think uh, it's necessary to celebrate yourself, to love yourself. And only once you do that, you spread positivity and love to the rest of the world. So my hats off to all the women out here, to the young girls, to the mothers, uh, who are really doing a wonderful job of balancing their work life and their professional life.